Good morning, my darlings. Yes, I just woke up. Yes, I do look crazy. I went out with a dear friend yesterday and something beautiful happened to me. First of all, a stranger complimented my outfit. Wow. Second of all, my friend asked me for my skincare routine. This means it works. It it works i'm so proud of it like i cleared my skin it took me months but i did it i made it i'm so proud of it like whenever someone comments on those little things like yes yes i am that girl i love to hang out like hang around the city with different people who have like different perspectives on this city because like whenever I hang out with her, she brings me to all those little places that I never noticed before or that I never go to with other people. And the same happens with every one of my friends. Like I, I feel like I have so many different type of friends that they could never work together as a group. But somehow I work well with every each one of them and what does that make me i mean i am a gemini so it might be it like I, I feel like i'm pretty friendly with everybody and i can find a way to make friends with literally any type of person i feel like also my energy is shifting more towards my feminine side something else that i notice is that with some people i feel like i probably feel more safe to be myself and i tap more into my feminine energy my feminine side and that makes me feel so happy and light i don't even know how to explain it and with some other people like i feel like i have to um kind of protect myself like my energy and i feel more like masculine energy coming out like something that i don't know i don't even know how to explain it but yesterday it was such a pleasant feeling to be so i don't know i felt like a princess almost and it's so cool to notice all those little things and sometimes I kind of feel crazy when I talk about it but please let me know have you noticed this also about you like I also think it is like completely normal to feel safer with some people instead of others but when I say safe like I mean they're all my friends okay I'm, I'm safe with all of them but you know with some people you can express yourself freely like a hundred percent and you can explore different sides of yourself and your personality and with some other people it's not really possible anyways in this video my mission is to romanticize life romanticize summer also when you are romanticizing every little thing that you do on your everyday life i feel like life gets so much funnier and prettier and this is what i want to do like i i felt so down in the last weeks i felt so sad and heavy like i don't want to feel like that anymore i want to romanticize life i want to romanticize summer we're in july like i cannot believe it we are like july is almost almost coming to an end when i'm posting this video this is crazy and of course i don't want to waste summer in my sadness no this is not a sad girl summer this is a romantic girl summer hopefully so this is what we're gonna do together also i keep forgetting to go to the library i need a book i need a new book i just keep forgetting it for some reason so we're gonna try it today hopefully i don't know <laughs>
my outfit for today. I don't know. I was in the mood for super baggy jeans and just a tank top actually. I love to wear tank tops during summer and this is fun. And jewelry, simple. I just need to run some errands, so we're gonna do that. I need actually quite a few things. I need to visit quite a few places. Tomorrow I'm going back to uni. It's it's a busy week, this one. I'm trying to romanticize it as much as I can so that every little thing feels like side quest and I don't get bored. I've had quite a weekend my bestie got rushed to the er so i spent all saturday there with her all night like oh i don't know like i'm so grateful that it was nothing serious like luckily she's fine she she feels like a bit tired but we spent so much time in there the place was like empty as i said i'm grateful that she she's okay she's fine thank god she is splendid but yeah it was like traumatizing honestly because i don't know in my mind if something bad had to happen like that would be on me like whenever i think about a tragic thing happening in my mind it always happens to me like the people around me the people that i love in my mind are like untouchable and whenever something like this happens i'm like what wait a minute what is going on like this is not supposed to be happening right now like why why what in my mind it is so it is impossible for them to get hurt for them to i don't know like that was traumatizing that was traumatizing it's monday now and like i haven't slept at all in the past two days i feel so out of my mind like i keep thinking about it and i feel so stressed out and anxious and crazy like oh my god like i know she's well i know she's doing fine but that was i i i'm speechless okay i'm just I'm so glad that everything went out, like everything in the end was fine. But I, I'm still anxious about it. Like, well, anyways, let's talk about something like meaningless and stupid, whatever. I need to find like a good product for my hair because I'm trying to let it grow like even more. I want very long and luscious hair but i get split ends and i hate that and i'm using like heat protectors i don't know i don't straighten my hair because i don't really like the look of that on me but i do use a hair dryer and that is very damaging so i i need to find like some good product for that sometimes life is just testing i think but can you stop? Can you stop testing me? Like, I got no, there is nothing left in here. I'm just, I, I just want to have like a good night of sleep. That's what I need, actually. I'm so tired. Sometimes I do feel like I need a vacation from my life. Like, people get a vacation to get away from their jobs. I need a vacation from my life because at this point it's too much. Paris, 
Mais le blues de Paris, je l'aime. Le blues de Paris m'envahit. Le blues de Paris. Le blues de Paris Le blues de Paris